Hey Dreamers and welcome back to my channel. Recently I have made a video introducing you to WOMP, a new 3D browser based software that makes it very easy and intuitive for anybody to get into 3D on PC. Quite a lot of you were interested and here's also a little insight on what people actually created for the art contest that I was promoting with the video. It's really lovely to see the creativity and possibilities. It reminds me a little bit to the early days of dreams as well. And talking about dreams, in this video we will be comparing the two since there's quite some similarities and I know that there's a lot of you who've been waiting for something that's similar to dreams on PC or just to be able to export your models, which is possible with WOMP. So now let's jump into it. This right here is our blank canvas on WOMP. The starting shapes are a lovely little example for the workflow it offers, which is very similar to dreams as well. In both, we create by combining primitives, blending them together or subtracting from each other in real time. I've actually tried to replicate the same thing for you guys in dreams. As you can see, it gives very similar results with slight differences in how the blending works. Another thing that's very similar in both is that we have two sliders for the materials slash finishes one for metalness and one for how shiny or rough it should be. Here I must say that WOMP is clearly ahead. The materials are just absolutely gorgeous looking and has actual real reflections with more ray tracing improvements to come as well as real glass and translucent materials which is definitely one of the biggest advantages of WOMP. The renders just look incredible while it's still all in real time workflow. It must also be said that WOMP is still in a very early stage, they plan on having a lot more updates, for example curves are still coming with the new update this week, but so far WOMP only has 3 primitives, in that case Dreams is just incredible, there's all kinds of primitives that you could wish for, as well as options to split them or make holds, which comes in really handy, and that's something that WOMP can still learn from. Talking about the primitives though. While we have a cube and a rounded cube in Dreams, WOMP has this really really incredible function next to the blend amount which lets us round up our shapes to our liking. We can do that with every shape and it definitely gives us a lot more control and possibilities. Now let's come to the next point, lighting. In Dreams we create our background and basic lighting with the sky gadget. In WOMP we have the backdrop which is a solid background color that we can choose and then we have the global lighting. The global lighting is a skybox image that will be reflected in our materials. This creates some really impressive results especially when it comes to those reflections. Apart from that we can simply use spotlights in both softwares. Both feature uh, colored spotlights as well. But what's really incredible about the spotlights and dreams is the images options. This would definitely be a really cool thing for WOMP as well. Now you've seen me create hundreds of times in dreams and so that you can actually get a glimpse of what it's like to create in WOMP, here's a bit of footage on how I'm creating using my graphics tablet. Even though you don't need one, I just find it more fun. And yeah, in the last video we made a cute robot character and I thought for this one I would give it a try to actually create a scene. So here I'll be going for an isometric cozy little home and I'll just let you guys enjoy the process now and be back for some more words by the end of this video.
a look at the final render. At the end you've seen me experiment quite a bit with the materials and lighting options which is a lot of fun to play around with, especially when it comes to the shiny stuff. Now the wonderful thing is that all of you can now also enter Womp and play around with it completely for free. They let a whole new wave of people into the alpha tomorrow, so just use the link in the description to sign up and have fun. And with that, I would like to thank Womp for sponsoring this video and for their mission to make 3D easily accessible and understandable for anybody. If you guys enjoyed this video, definitely make sure to give it a like, some feedback and share it with others. Thank you for watching, I'll see you in the next video.